Leaders, government officials, private sector, employees, and people nationwide on Wednesday, June 1st, planted trees to mark Arbor Day, aiming to increase forest cover and raise public awareness of the importance of trees. President Bunyang Warajit led officials at the presidential office in planting trees in the grounds. while Prime Minister Tong Lun Sisulit led staff at the Prime Minister's office in planting saplings to create a greener environment around the building. The President planted a Kenhua tree or Hopia, one of the indigenous species of the country. Other senior officials included Vice President Pan Kam Vi Pawan and President of the National Assembly, Pani Yatotu. <laughs> Prime Minister Tonglun Sisulit also planted a Hopia tree at the Prime Minister's office. Realizing the ambitious plan to have young trees planted on 24,000 hectares of land across the country to mark National Arbor Day, the government has encouraged all sectors, members of the public and the business community to take part in the tree planting effort. The government has set a target to return the country's forest coverage to 70% by 2020. <laughs> Meanwhile, the children got first hand to visit the Prime Minister's office where he works. Elsewhere, Deputy Prime Minister Dr. Son Sai Si Pandon, members of the public, civil servants, soldiers, police officers, and students planted trees at the Nam Suang Forest Science Research Center in Na Sai Tong District, Vieng Chan. In 2001, Laos forest coverage was 41%, but officials are currently conducting a survey to determine the present figure. Tree planting activities to mark National Arbor Day has been conducted since 1975, but have picked up considerably in the last 10 years. The Ministry of Agriculture and Forestry hosted an official ceremony to mark this year's Arbor Day. Speaking at the ceremony, Minister of Agriculture and Forestry Dr. Lian Tikel reminded the gathering of the statistics on forest cover in recent decades. <laughs> He referred to a survey conducted in 1992 which founded that 47% of the country was forested that year. By 2002, forest cover had declined to 41.5% but rose to 46.7% last year thanks to Arbor Day campaigns and annual reforestation efforts. He commented on unregulated forest encroachment which he said had increased in some areas and degraded forests causing a loss of natural resources. Dr. Lian also recalled a speech given by President Gai Son Pongvihan at a national forest meeting held in 1989. The president noted that forest encroachment had reached alarming levels and said it was time to start harvesting trees and put an end to unregulated forest encroachment. He also stressed the importance of tree planting and protection. <laughs> Through a Prime Ministerial Directive, a Presidium Resolution and the Law on Forestry, June 1st was declared to be National Children's Day and Arbor Day. These events aim to build awareness among the younger generation of the importance of forests and the need to continually maintain and sustain forests. The government is targeting forest cover of 70% by 2020 through the rehabilitation of 6 million hectares of natural forests and the planting of trees on 500,000 hectares. <laughs>